Hey, it's the Average Guy coming to you with another quick product review. Now, I have this hat on in tribute to this product that I'm about to review. There's a place in San Antonio, Texas, and other parts of Texas, I believe, called Bucky's, which is like a mega convenience store. If you're ever in the San Antonio area, check them out. Bucky's is like a convenience store on steroids. And I've made a video about it. I'm going to put a link to that video in the description box below. you got to check it out. So this bright red hat with the cute little Bucky on it is in tribute to this product. Strongbow Hard Cider Cherry Blossom Flavor. All right, guys. Now, Strongbow, they do a tremendous job in marketing. In fact, last year, I did a video about Strongbow and I compared it to some other hard ciders and what caught my eye were these commercials where you had this horse like running on a beach in slow motion. I have no idea of the correlation between a horse in slow motion running on the beach with apple cider but it was cool and I'm a sucker for marketing. Now wait a minute, a horse running on the beach in slow motion. If you have a case of these, I think pretty much everything will be running in slow motion. Now, in my video last year, I compared Strongbow to Angry Orchard and Red's Apple Ale, I believe. And I'll leave a link to that video in the description box below so you can check out my thoughts and, and see that video. But now I'm going to check out this new flavor that looks pretty interesting. Hard Apple Ciders with Cherry Blossom. Cut through refreshing taste trying to see how much alcohol it's gluten free by the way enjoy responsibly how much alcohol is in these things four and a half percent alcohol by volume all right so now i can't wait to get home and check out this little libation because i can't be drinking this in the car drink responsibly guys now i'm not typically all that fond of fruity drinks because those things can slip up on you, but with 4.5% alcohol by volume, you're not taking too much of a risk unless you drink like a case of these. Now, I did have uh, some issues with a particular moonshine that had fruit on it, because, you know, the fruit, real fruit, yo, kind of masks the taste a little bit, and you, that, that'll sneak up on you. Now, I'm going to leave a link to that video as well in the description box below. You can check out that video. Moonshine. With fruit on it. With cherry flavored. Now, I'm going to get home and see how the Strongbow is. All right. I'm here for the Strongbow taste test. Let's see what we got here. Very fruity smell to it. Smell the cherries. Proof is in the pudding, right? Bottoms up. So right up front, you're met with that really nice fruity cherry taste. Goes down smooth, little bit of a grab at the end to let you know there is a little bit of a alcohol happening. Very nice, very nice. Nice for a spring day or a summer day out at a cookout, you know, if you don't want to drink beer and you want to kick it though, strong bow. Now I could see how after a while these might add up a little bit, but I am uh, well done, well done. And I, and I think to date, this is probably my favorite strong bow. So there you have it guys, another honest alcohol review from the average guy. I would give Strongbow Cherry Blossom a thumbs up. You, know, you want something a little bit different? Again, look in the description box below. I'm going to leave a couple of links to other videos that I've made around the apple cider and uh, drinks with fruit on them variety. And I'll see you guys next time. Ah! Real fruit, yo.